Well, hello everyone, and welcome not to the physics playground. We are in Nave's Gain today. Or Nava's Gain, you can tell me off in the comments. But why are we here? Because we are visiting the Canyon Cliff Dwellings, as recommended by subscriber Bella. And of course, cannot be taken up as any quest to the trader, but it has loads of lovely secrets. Canyon underscore cliff underscore dwellings what does it have to offer well it's rather plain and stone like and there's lots and lots of little doors and entrances let's go and have a look the first one is locked let's do a lot of door bashing i'll tell you that right now Whahey! and you find lots of empty rooms well they're not all empty but you know what i mean there's rooms like that some of them are locked some of them are also unlocked there's plenty of cooking pots around it could be a nice base, couldn't it, if you uh, wanted to get stuck here in Nave's game. Come on, wakey, wakey. Uh, in the hot and arid, horrible area here. There we go, locked and unlocked. It's all a bit all over the place. There's weird little bits with ladders to fix and stuff. But let's go and do the ground floor first. There we go, look at that, another cooking pot. Gorgeous. And random little ways. You can even see down the back of the whole POI, which is rather weird. And, uh, well, you know... I don't know quite what you'd do with that, but uh, it's just the way it's placed. And in here we have more. Let's have a look. Was that open? It was. Cooking part, room. Oh, a room with a little first floor area. Very, very nice. And we keep going. And eventually we come around here. What's in here? This one's locked. Oh, hello. Have I woken someone up? Hello. Oh, your arm's off. Your other arm's off. Boom, your head's off. Uh, where was I? Sorry. I got a little excited there. Um, yeah, another little room. Uh, we'll keep on going round. Is that local? Or is, oh, no, it's someone in here. Hello. What can I get? Can I get your head straight off? That'll do. And then there's little rooms like this. More cooking pots. And as we go up and up, we find locked areas. And I think it was out here. There's somewhere there's a little balcony. Oh, it's the one above me, isn't it? Anyway, we'll find that in a bit. So that's it, really. That's that's the main little bit. The, the proper way of getting up, you can go up this ladder. Um, or there's another ladder, I think, over here somewhere. Oh, here it is. This is what I'm looking for. Or oh, is that a local? Oh, local. Sorry, dude. You are getting in the way of the video. You're not allowed to be here. So we're going to come up this way next. And be careful of these. You can fall in and really hurt yourself. Uh, if you jump across there, this little hatch that is locked... So we're going to try this. I don't. I haven't put any parkour into my character. I know I can make it. There we go. And there's the tunnel. The next little stage. So plenty of nice little rooms. That one is unlocked. The next one is unlocked. It's all just room after room after room. So this could be a lovely horde base. And I have done a few hordes over the years in this classic little POI in Nave's game. Because uh, when the, uh, the zombies spawn, a lot of them spawn at a distance. So they actually are up above and they fall down into the canyon. It's quite funny to watch, to be fair. Oh, there's that little door. Well, let's leap across here and see what we got. We got some zombies. Uh, guarding this final little section. Bosh! Uh, I might take your leg out. Let's take your leg out. Come on. There we go. Let's jump over here. And I'll take your... Uh, I might take your other leg out. Can I take your other leg out? Yes, I can. Uh, what about your arm? No? Uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, I'll just get to your head. Oh, my God. He's a tough one, isn't he, down there? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not sorry. Uh, let's get open this up. I think this is a construction one, is it? Yes, it is a construction site box. Oh, thank you very much for the 17 frames. We'll get this fella out of the way as well. Can I do like some kind of like kind of jumpy thing and no, that was trying to be cool then. Trying to be cool, but I'm not that cool. So well, I'll just rip his head off. Then we've got a locked door. We'll try and wake some people up, see if they'll come to us. I don't know if they will. Uh, it's probably easier to get through here than it is the 800. And a little bit extra as you go through the doors there. But we'll break these out and just uh, cheekily nip around the side and come in to see what else we have hidden away. So there's our zombies. Anyone here? Anyone here? Oh, there's someone above me running into the room. Mm, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll leave you to that, mate. And I'll go and whack this guy around the head a couple of times. Who else is here? Anyone? Anyone? No, no, no. That's odd. I've never seen that before. Normally this isn't boarded up quite like this. Um, oh gosh, they've, have they all come down from down there? I think they have. Well, I've got lots of ferals today. Let's get rid of some of these. Oh, you're a tough crowd today. A tough crowd. Oh my golly gosh. 
Oh my golly gosh. <laughs> I think I put too many levels into this character to make the video. There we go. That's better. So there's a little kind of gravy area down here and all these different rooms. Normally, I, this I'm just saying a little bit odd. Um, normally, this I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually type in CR space D, get change the deco. Yeah, normally it looks like that. That's a little odd. Maybe it's a bit of a glitch. Anyway, let's get through. What have we got? We've got a workbench here. Nice. We'll have some of that. And then we've got these little side rooms. Oh, and some final loot. Let's do the side rooms first, shall we? I'll get the admin gun out just to make my life a little bit easier. We're going to come in here. And in this one, we have a, ooh, a white casket. They all have different caskets. Sometimes it's teal. Sometimes it's uh, different colors anyway. In here, we've got a sealed shipping crate with some hidden stash. Oh, very nice indeed. A few toys can be found in there. In this little area, we have... Look at this. This is the first of our chests today. The Mountain Man chest. And in here, we uh, usually find some antibiotics or something like that. Boing, boing. In here, we've got nothing. There is... Uh, not all of them have anything in it. In this one, we have just a bit of trash, which is going to give me some gorgeousness. And in here, uh, we have... Uh, oh, we've got a, a brown casket this time with more rotting flesh. So, then we have the end loot. Not cheesable in any way, because we are now deep underground. But it's a good place to come. There's a weapons bag too. And I think I'll just do this quickly today. We've got two boxes, a Mo's power. Oh, look at that. The drone schematic. Lovely. And a savage country with some bow parts. Nice. And then finally, without having to leave here, there is another casket. So we go to the purple. And the purple's got some bones in it. But do not stop there. Do not head out of this POI. Because we have a broken penis monument thing and all we want to do is get our shovel out so bring your shovel because when you knock through there is the apache artifact chest in this poi too so both of the super secret chests are in this poi oh yes and you have the taza stone axe then i've got some money as well thank you very much now let's compare a tier six to the Taz of the Taz is still not very good, but I only got a tier one. You can get up to a tier five, I believe. Maybe even a tier six. I'm not sure. I never got one before, but you can get up to a tier five for sure, I know, in this little chest. And there you go. That is the Canyon underscore Cliff underscore dwellings here in Knave's game. You won't find it anywhere else. You won't find it in generated maps. This is exclusive for this. It's rather nifty and lovely. And uh, yeah, I remember in the past I used to dig tunnels through all of this and have loads and loads of fun. Oh, more locals just to say goodbye at the end. What should we do to you? Should we just... Oh, I used the admin gun. I wanted to chop your legs off. No one else about? Yes, there's this fella. But anyway, what do you think of it? Please tell me in the comments below uh, what you think of all of this uh, palaver. Have you ever been here? Have you ever done anything interesting with this? Uh, have you... Uh, oh, hello. I'm just trying to get... Ah, come on. Oh, well. Have you ever made anything interesting? Uh, just tell me the kind of things that you've been doing because you could make a nice mine in there. Ow! Ow! Watch out for the cacti as well. But it's all rather lovely and interesting and a little bit different. So please make sure that you hit the like if you've enjoyed the video. Subscribe for loads more content. And I say, tell us in the comments. Or in fact, why not use the link to the Discord? And you can join Bella and recommend POIs that we should go through. I'll see you later. Goodbye!